Hey everyone, I hope you're having a good day and today I have my MC bag. I'm so excited. I actually looked up the other day like when I got it last month and I feel like and I was like, oh, I still have another week or so. And so, to my surprise, I got it. So, I'm sure it was my math that was off. But, anyway, I haven't opened it. So, let me rip into it and see. The um, bag that they gave us last month was this little um, clear plastic hot pink bag. And I have used it for all of my lip products in my purse. And I love that little bag. So, anyway. Okay. What have we got? All right. This is the first thing I see. I haven't even looked at it. Okay, paper. Girls just want to have fun. You're invited to throw a Benefit Cosmetics Lash Bash for your BFFs. And, oh, it like tells you to have, okay, so you can enter to win and maybe they come to your house and you have a party. Yeah, I don't know. I have to look into that. Okay, next is Glamour Academy. So I'm guessing that's this month's title. It's Glamour Academy, and it's got all the names of the products that you might receive, and I see Michael Todd as one of them, and I hear on here all the time people talking about Michael Todd, like face cleaner and all that, so maybe I'll get something Michael Todd. Okay, so here's the little bag, and it's like a fuchsia purple um, magenta and it's got a gold like medallion on it kind of like a prep school and it says glamour academy so it's cute not my favorite but it's cute and i like purple and gold so there you go okay so that's the inside it looks like some good stuff okay first thing ooh, urban decay okay i'm excited about this get primed and ready for action 24 7 glide on lip pencil if I can get into it. Ooh, look. So that's all the different colors. And let's see. Ah, they've got it packaged good. Okay. Creamy Badass Luxury. Um, 20 Intensely Pigmented Creamy Shades. All right, so here we go. How cute is this? Is it a lipstick? Oh, that is the cutest thing I've ever seen. Look at that little baby lipstick. Of course, it's red. I don't wear a lot of red, but who cares? Okay, it's really creamy and really pigmented. How precious is that? And I don't know what color. Okay, my color is the shade you're holding is number 69. It doesn't, I don't, I don't know what color. I, oh, hold on. Maybe if I look on the number. Mm. I can't tell. There's no color. I don't know why there's not a color, but it looks like Bang. Out of all the color samples, the only one that's like a real red is Bang. So anyway, super cute. Love that. I like to wear a, more of a red lip in the winter, so I might have to try it before then though. Okay, next thing I'm pulling out is a Mica Beauty Cosmetics Shimmer Powder in Bronze. Look at that. That's a full size. I don't know what it is. Um, shimmer powder, so I'm guessing it's like a pigment. That's what I'm thinking it is. I'm thinking it's an eyeshadow pigment. Yeah. For sure. It looks kind of like, um, I just bought one of the Maybelline color, the 24-hour pigments, and it looks same like packaging. Oh, it's a pretty color. Can you see that on my hand? Very pretty. Okay, so that's exciting. So that is a full-size product right there. Okay, what's next? Three more things. Okay, <gasps> oh, very excited about this. Smashbox, the Photo Finish Foundation Primer. I have just tested this out in the stores, but I have never bought the Smashbox Primer, and I love primers, and I always see, like, checking out at Sephora and Ulta, even the little ones are, like, $17. I'm just like, ugh. That's just so expensive. And so, I'm either really cheap or not cheap at all. So, this is something I'm very cheap on. Okay, so let me try it. Okay, it looks very silicone-y. I feel like a lot of people have used this and love it. Yeah, it's very silicone-y and smooth. Almost silicone-y and creamy. So, that makes me super, super excited. Ah! This is a good bag. Okay, 
Next is from Pixie, and it is a Lash Booster Mascara. Yay! I'm not going to open it because it's super sealed, but that's exciting. I like the Pixie, the primer that they gave us a few months back. Okay, and the last thing, <gasps> Michael Todd Pumpkin Nutrient Rich Facial Mask. Look at that sample. Holy cow. It's, a whole, it's one fluid ounce, moisturizes and nourishes all um, skin types except sensitive. <laughs> all skin types except, except sensitive. <laughs> so I guess if you're sensitive, you don't get it. Okay, I'm going to squeeze out a little bit. Well, it's sealed. Never mind. Let's see. Let's see if I can get it open. I'm curious to see if it smells pump. Okay, it's orange. It actually smells like pumpkin. Look. It smells kind of like like a sweet potato baby food. It's a little bit gritty. Hmm. I'm very intrigued by this. Okay. So that was everything. This is a super, super good month. Oh my gosh. I'm really, really loving Ipsy. Um, if you don't know what Ipsy is, which you probably do, but um, it is a monthly subscription site. It's $10 a month, and you just get a little bag every month filled with usually about five, I'd say four to five high-end beauty samples and some full size, and I absolutely love it. Um, a few months back, I canceled Birchbox to go solely with Ipsy because I just think it's way better. But if you don't, that's okay. But anyway, so that is so exciting. That, I mean, look at those products. Yay! I'm so happy. So anyway, um, so that is my Ipsy for this month. And where I normally end it now, I've got a few other things. I just figured I'd throw in a little haul here at the end. I just went to Sephora a while ago. This is just really quick. I got a new beauty blender. And yeah, my other one was looking, I still use it, but it's looking really bad. So, a new beauty blender, what can I say? And I just throw it out. Oh well. And I got some goodies from Sigma. Anyway, I love their brushes. They're comparable to MAC and all that, but they're much less expensive. And yeah, I love them. So, I got um, the Large Angled Contour Brush, which is the F40. And I wanted this brush for blush. And that's what that looks like. And I have... I tried to get this at Christmas when I got my other brushes and they were out of this one. I have tried to order this brush so many times and it's always out of stock. So when I saw it was back in stock, I jumped on it. And so anyway, I've never used it before, but it's super soft and I'm very excited to use that. So the F40 and then I didn't get much, just really quick. Then the um, pencil brush is the E30. You can never have too many pencil brushes. I think they're amazing and I haven't tried any. I'm trying to find the one I used a while ago. I haven't found any other pencil brushes that I love. Like I love this pencil brush and here you can see that one. I used it a while ago. Um, what I like for it is like how it's kind of dark here in my crease. I just put a little tiny line like that and then I took a blending brush and blended it out. So that's what I like to use pencil brushes for. I can just be so much more precise. And then I got a set of tweezers. They just sucked me in. They were cute. And I feel like, um, let's see, the brow tweezer, you know, it's their customized ones. Anyway, so that's what that looks like. I just feel like I have a love-hate relationship with tweezers, so I've never had a nice set of tweezers, so I thought, let me just get a nice set of tweezers, and I can already tell I like the way they feel. Okay, and then random, which I thought this was cute. If you know much about Sigma, you know a while back they came out with this brush cleaning glove, and anyway, a brush cleaning glove, which it looks like this. It's rubbery. Now, this is my KitchenAid this is my KitchenAid pot holder, but I do not have one of the brush cleaning gloves, but from the videos I've seen, it looks just like this. Now, I have actually, since then, I've used this to clean my brushes just one time, just to kind of get the idea, see if it would be something I was interested in. Now, theirs is, you know, copyrighted or whatever, patented, and it's not this, but this is just the look of it. I didn't like wearing this to clean my brushes at all. But when I ordered 
this they sent me a little mini sample of their brush glove which i thought this was precious so look at this right here it's i mean it's you know comparable to my hand and you can put it in your hand and it has like all these different like it says rinse wash um refine oh it says patent pending actually but um anyway so it's just different like textures and it says you can watch a video on how to do it um I think this is precious, but I think the whole idea of this washing spa glove is kind of cheesy. I haven't personally used it, so I can't tell you. Anyway, with all that said, it has a $5 off um, coupon code, and I think they're like $40, which just kind of blows me away. But anyway, if you're interested in getting the glove, it is. it says the coupon code is SPA GLOVE all cap locks and it ends on um 12 31 2013 so i will put that below i don't get anything from this i just figured if you're wanting to try this it's five dollars off so and i think that is precious but um i don't know what i'll do with it but i think it's cute so anyway that was just a random little let me throw in a little haul in there with my ipsy bag that was an awesome month for ipsy it just to me it just seems to keep getting better and better and better which makes me very excited so anyway all right i think that is everything if you have any questions or comments please leave it below and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you're not subscribed please do subscribe i love it so much when i get new subscribers and i love all of you that are my subscribers and i love when you comment and talk to me below and all that good stuff so anyway all right i hope you're having a good day and i will talk to you next time bye